name is Jasmine and I am going to do this video because I want to actually express my thoughts on Pretty Little Liars and the season finale and what the heck happened. Okay, so basically I was shocked but not really because my three suspects who I thought were A or who they were going to reveal as A were either Garrett, Melissa, or Mona. Mona because, I mean, everyone seems shady. Everyone in the story is shady. Everyone seems like they did something and everyone lies and everyone does something. I feel like everyone has motives to be A. But Mona because, I haven't read the books, but the people that have read the books and I've like, people have been telling me and whatever, I know who A is in the book. Um, But I really do want to read it. But people have said that in the book, A is Mona. So I'm like, maybe they're going to do it like the book. So that's why I thought Mona was it I thought it was Melissa because Melissa is shady and she does kind of have like an evil thing in her like like she likes revenge I guess and um I thought her motive was because Allie liked Ian and Ian did stuff with Allie and I don't know the, just the last couple of episodes she's been looking so shady and she saw Mona and Caleb kissing so when Hannah got the text I thought that you know that was because of her but actually it was Mona because wow she was the one that's a so she's the one that knows obviously cause she was there but um and i thought it was garrett too because garrett is just a shady cop he's not he's not real and him with jenna that duel like really scared me and um i don't know so that's why i just thought it was garrett because garrett is shady too i feel like well mona when she was revealed she was telling spencer oh join the a team so i definitely know that the next season like she's not a but she's part of that team like they help a they help them so there's definitely going to be more people that in that team that are helping like the leader a um do all these things because a can't be in in one place all the time so there's definitely more than one person and mona was just like i don't know she was just a psycho that was revealed first but um, I could see her be definitely being A and wanting to get revenge on all of them because they took Han away from her and they were Allie's friends and Allie's made her life living hell. But um, wow, like this story, like I don't know, I, this is this has made me love Pretty Little Liars just a lot more because it's turning into like this psychotic, like crazy, like revenge story and. I don't know it's just getting more scarier like I was really scared that last episode like Mona really scared me she the way she went after Spencer the way she was like about to kill her basically um I don't know but just made me like everything a lot more and I didn't know she was like that like I don't know how a person can be like that like she really has problems she's really psycho and insane like and then they said that she was really really smart like that's why she's so psycho and she like she like I don't know um it just, it's just gonna take me a while to keep processing this because so much has happened in the last two seasons and like this big like dramatic ending it's like wow and Maya just died like really like A you really had to kill Maya like I didn't like Maya that much for Emily but like that was a horrible thing to do because Emily really loved her and she Maya was like no part in this so I don't know why A had to get its hands on her so um, I didn't like that Maya was killed off because I was just like a bit too dramatic or extreme or something. Um, but I definitely think that Garrett and Jenna are still like, you know, are still kind of shady because Jenna now sees, like she can see out of one eye and she still hasn't told anyone. So I just feel like she's just being shady. Um, well, wow, there's so much shadiness in this episode on this show. Um, I definitely think Lucas is part of it because he was helping A. Like, he was about to, like, kill Hannah in one of those episodes. Well, not really, but I don't know. He called that crisis hotline, and he was the one that I think Hannah ran over with her car. Um, so I think Lucas is part of it, and Melissa, I don't know. She just has a secret. Like, I think she did something, but it wasn't that that big, but she still did something. And when Spencer was like, oh... Are you part of this? Did you do something? That's why she got really defensive because I think she did something, but it wasn't too, too big. But I still, like, want to know what happened. Like, like what did Ian and Garrett and Jason and Melissa, like, what did they do? Like, because obviously something happened that night. 
and that guy that um Ali's friends or Vivian's friends that guy that has a helicopter like I I'm still confused in that part like he flew her to somewhere and I don't know um yeah oh my gosh the show's amazing and I just can't wait for the summer because the summer's gonna be the best summer ever because just can't wait to see like everything that happens and I know that A is still not really revealed like it's the team that's gonna be getting revealed but it's like I feel like it's gonna be a while till like the real A is revealed and I feel like they're they are gonna still keep doing it like the book because Mona like is the first A I guess um so they're probably gonna do it like the books like with the twins and everything and I really do want to read the books I think I will even though I don't like reading um that's basically it. That's basically all my thoughts on it. I mean, I have so much more to say, but I'm gonna stop. But I, I want to show you guys something. I got a fish recently. My fish's name is Doria, and I got her for free because my school was giving them out for free. And I just really want her to stay alive. I love animals. Um, yeah, that's Doria. <laughs>